Um, hi guys, welcome to this video. This is Dennis from Sport at Home Tour here in Valencia. We'll be checking out um, a really pretty, uh, cool apartment, okay? So uh, we're gonna see more or less uh, how the distribution of the apartment looks like, okay? Uh, we're gonna see um, pretty much what we got over here. So um, to sum up, okay, um, since the distribution is pretty uh, difficult to uh, check out now, we're gonna take it in a few seconds. So um, overall, we find four bedrooms, okay? We got two bathrooms, we got one living room, one kitchen, we got the entrance and we also got a um, balcony attached to the living room space. So overall, as you can imagine, it is a pretty, pretty big apartment, okay? Uh, we got kind of the entrance, which is uh, extends in a corridor, which turns into the left and then turns into the right, okay? Where we got divided um, the whole of the apartment, okay? So really, really big overall. Everything is really nicely um, distributed and furnished, okay? Really modern. Spaces are really nicely um decorated okay as so we will see throughout the whole apartment and everything's looking really really neat also the neighborhood is pretty chill to live in and at the same time we've got um, all these services that a normal um, neighborhood would offer so that's also um, pretty pretty important okay so we're gonna go now first over here and we're gonna start off checking out the distribution okay so as we mentioned we got balcony we got the living room area we got bedroom number one bedroom number two then if we go through this door, which separates the living room with this corridor, we would find um, bathroom number one over here, bathroom number two over here, okay? And going to this side, we got bedroom number three, we got bedroom number four, we got the entrance, and we got the kitchen over here. Okay, so we're gonna brace ourselves actually over here on the door. Okay, so this would be exactly what we would see if we cross the entrance. Okay, so really neat, really wide open. First thing that we see is in a straight line um, over here, bedroom number four. And to this other side, okay, we've got the rest of the entrance with a window to the kitchen, which we're going to check out in just a few moments. Okay, so as we mentioned, we go first off to check out bedroom number four. We got it over here. Okay, looking really nice and neat. We got... Um, this kind of couch bed over here. We've got some cushions. We've got a picture. We've got a light from the ceiling. We've got a table. We've got this mat on the floor. Okay, notice uh, colors match really, really nicely. We've got a rounded table. We've got a mirror. And to the side, we've got this window, okay, which also has um, this piece where we can cover up the window, okay, where we've got this interior part of use. Now, if we go out of bedroom number four, Okay, we turn to the right, we go in a straight line, just a few steps, turn to the right, and we check out bedroom number three. So, looking really nice and neat, we got a double sized bed situated um, pretty much in the middle of the bedroom. We got two tables situated at each of the sides of the bed, which are also topped off with lights. Okay, to the side we got a window, okay, also with this store too, and pretty much um, same views of this interior patio. Okay, and turning to the side, we've got this piece of furniture, which is pretty unique, has a really nice style in decoration. Uh, as you can see, we've got several different drawers, so we've got quite a lot of storage, and we also got more furniture to this side. Okay, now if we go uh, pretty much in this line over here, we head into the kitchen area, which is really, really modern, really neatly decorated, okay, looking really neat. We've got these kind of patterns on the floor which makes it super cool also these kind of walls are really nice which contrasts super good with these other um, colors okay and we find a really neat kitchen overall okay super modern we got a lot of space for storage as you can see several different doors we got a microwave over here we got our sink we got our, our oven we also got our cooking fires just on top of the oven okay to the side, we got this window, which has these views over here. Okay. And to the side, we got more doors, so a lot of space for storage. Now turning to the side, we got um, this table. Okay, really neat. We got also some chairs so we can sit down. So really cool kitchen overall. Now we're gonna head over here to the corridor. We're gonna go up until the end, turn to the right. Okay, and we got this super long corridor, which we're gonna follow in a straight line. Turning to the side, we got bathroom number two, okay? 
So we got the toilet, we got a shower, okay, really modern as we can see. Everything's also super clean, which is really nice. To this side, we got the sink, which has a really cool design too, and we've got a rounded mirror on the top. Now we're gonna head into bathroom number one, which is the next stop over here, turning to the right once again, where we find massive, massive mirror, as you can see, occupying pretty much um, all of this width of the wall. We also got a really nice sink, okay, really cool design. We can also hang our towels over here. To this side, we got the toilet. We got a window where we're receiving some lights from this interior patio that we saw previously. And to this side, we got the shower. Okay, also has a really cool um, style, really nice patterns decorating the walls. Okay, so now we're gonna head over here. Follow the corridor in a straight line up until the end. As we mentioned, we can separate the living room from the corridor with this door, which is always a plus. And we find this living room area, which is really, really big. Okay, and it's also super nicely decorated. So starting to the side, we got this table with a chair. We got some pictures. We got another um, seat over here. We also find a light, okay, really nice if we want to read, just chill. Turning to this side, we got really nice couch decorating the side of the living room. Also, we got a table in the center and a really, really big mat um, decorating the rest of the living room, okay? If we go to this side, we also got this light. We got a really massive uh, flat TV screen situated um, over here attached to the wall, so really, really cool. We got another piece of furniture. And to this side, we got the access to the balcony, okay? We'll find space over here. We got a chair where we can also sit down to read or whatever. And we got the street views over here. Okay, and to this side. Now going back inside of the living room. Okay, we're gonna check out first of bedroom number two, which we got attached to the living room. We find it over here. Okay, as you can see, we got a lot of furniture. We got a table. We got this um, standalone wardrobe with a lot of space for storage. Okay, and to the side we got a window with um, same interior part of views that we've been seeing throughout the apartment, also with a store. Now we're gonna check out the last part of the apartment, which is um, bedroom number one. We got it over here, attached to the living room too. And this is a really, really cool um, bedroom, okay? As we see, main bedroom over here. We got this um, wall pretty much occupied by the standalone wardrobes, which are really, really nicely equipped with several different shelves. Okay, we also got some space over here for our jewelry. We find some drawers, so really, really nice and neat. To this other side, we got this double-sized bed. Okay, also with the bed lining, super nicely presented. We got two tables at each of the sides of the um, bed. Also with some lights and a mirror in the center. We got a mat on the floor over here. And to this side, we also got um, this table with a rounded mirror and this chair. Okay. Also, we got this window, so this means uh, that this is an exterior bedroom since we got the street views over here. Okay, so really neat. We can also cover it up with these curtains, so uh, if we wanna, don't want to let the light go through. Okay, guys, so um, this has been the visit for today. This has been Dennis from Spot at Home. We're reading you just over here, and let's see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.